Hey everybody. So last night I saw the most embarrassing and pathetic thing I have seen on NHL ice this entire season. And, and I was furious watching it last night and I am still furious about it today. And it's Essa Lindell's Olympic level diving display with Robert Bortuzzo last night. And if you if you if you haven't seen it, uh, I saw this live watching it, and I've seen the replay multiple times. If you haven't seen it, just search Essa Lindell diving. It, it's all over social media this morning. Uh, it's all over YouTube. It's it. I'll I'll give you a quick like re idea of what happened here. So Lindell and there's a, there's one of those you know kind of a scrum along the wall. Uh, where both, you know, two, three guys from each team are fighting for the puck. And uh, Lindell is there for Dallas and Bortuzzo's there for St. Louis. And Bortuzzo gives Lindell a little shove in the back. And Lindell just fl goes flying face first down like an absolute idiot. Um, he, he looked like a fish flopping out of the water. Like he's up on the on the boat deck, just flopping around trying to get back into the water. It was ri absolutely ridiculous, and that was only the first dive. Wait, there's more. So then he gets back up, and Bortuzzo, who's already clearly ticked off, gives him a nice hard cross check in the back, and Lindell feels the cross check, and then it's like, oh, he just hit me again, and literally dives face first towards the boards after the cross check. So at this point, the ref's calling both guys. Uh, he's got Bortuzzo for the cross check and Lindell for the dive. Lindell gets up again, and and this time, and at this point, Robert Bortuzzo is out of his mind, angry. And Lindell gets up again, and Bortuzzo pops him right in the chest, gives him a nice shove right in the chest. And Lindell acts like the Marine Sniper Division is up in the balcony and snaps his head back like he just got JFK'd. And, and he flops down on the ice again for the third time. For the third time. Three dives in a row from Essa Lindell. It was the most embarrassing and pathetic display of diving I have seen in the NHL all season. And, and maybe in a number of years. Nothing else comes to... There's obviously recency bias here because this was last night, and there may be some that I'm forgetting from the past few years, but this, to me, was the worst display of diving that I've seen in the past few years in the NHL, and it was it's an utter disgrace to hockey. Um, this, is, this is the kind of garbage you expect to see on the soccer field in the basketball court, not anywhere near a hockey rink, and there is absolutely no place in the game for this. I don't care if you're a Dallas fan, fan or not. You cannot, no one in any way can defend this at all. This is absolute garbage from Essa Lindell. And I think he should be suspended. He should sit a game for this crap. Because this is an absolute embarrassment to the league and to the sport of hockey. We, we don't do this crap in hockey. This is, other sports may do it. Basketball, it's brutal. Soccer, it's even worse. I mean, soccer is a poster child for diving. But we don't do this in hockey. This has no place in the sport of hockey. And it was absolutely disgusting to watch. And I'm still furious about it the next morning. Because it was such a, such a blatant display. And, and the worst part is Lindell was laughing about it and smiling about it after he did it. Like, he, this was a, this was a joke to him. He didn't care. He, someone needs to pull him aside and, and teach him that this, this has no place in the game of hockey. It's an absolute disgraceful move. And I, he's, he's going to be fined, I would think. The NHL does not want this crap being let go. So he's, I, I'm assuming he's going to be fined. I would suspend him. The league's not going to suspend him for diving. I would suspend him. He needs to sit for a game to, to be taught that this has no place in the game. And the fact that, and this wasn't just one dive. This wasn't one incident where he's trying to call, draw a penalty call. He dove three times in a row. Three times in a row. Which he clearly thinks is an okay thing to do. So he needs to be punished from the league. 
and and he needs to be sent a clear clear message that this has no place in the game because this is the most this is the most embarrassing thing I've seen on the ice this season in the NHL just absolutely pitiful and disgusting to watch and Honestly, if I was a fourth liner on St. Louis, I would just beat the crap out of him. First period of next game, his first shift, what the hell do I care? I'm a fourth liner. I would go knock his teeth in. I would knock his teeth in and tell him to pick him up off the ice. Because it's just, it's disgraceful to the league. It's disgraceful to the sport. It's disgraceful to all the other players in the league. It's just the, the worst thing I have seen on the ice this year was that. That pathetic flopping like he's a freaking soccer player. Just an absolute joke. It's a joke. And there is no place for that garbage in hockey. If you think that that's okay or that he was, oh, he's just trying to draw a penalty call. That's a smart thing to do. Get the, get out, get out. You don't belong watching the sport of hockey. Don't, you don't. Turn it off, go watch soccer, go watch basketball, get the hell away from hockey if you think that's okay. Because that is absolute garbage, and it's disgraceful. That, that kind of crap has no place in the game. You, you don't flop around and dive like a little prince. You know, he looks like Peter Griffin falling down the stairs in every episode of Family Guy. Like, get your ass up, you loser. Get up. I don't know how Bortuzzo didn't just beat the living crap out of him. Because I would have, if I was playing, I would have snapped at that. That would have set me off to where I would have just started pounding him. Punching his teeth in. Absolute disgrace. I have no idea, no idea why he thought that was an okay thing to do. And and the, the league has got to send a message here. Fine him the maximum allowed under the CBA. Find him as much as you possibly can. And I would they're not going to suspend him, but I would. I would tell him to sit his ass down for a game. Because that is gross. Absolutely gross. I wanted to puke watching that. No place in hockey for that trash. So, Lindell, I mean, what a, what a, just the worst thing I've seen this year. What an absolute disgrace. Um, and I, I hope... I hope somebody finds him and, and catches him. I hope he gets caught with his head down. I hope he gets run through the glass by somebody. I hope I would love to see Patrick Maroon just grab him and start throwing punches. That would be the best remedy for that. But uh, whatever happens, just what a pathetic and disgraceful display of diving by Essel Lindell last night. And it is... I'm still furious about it, and it is the most embarrassing and pathetic thing I've seen on NHL ice in a long time. So with that, like, comment, share, subscribe, fo uh, follow on social media. All those links are down in the description. Keep, If you'd like to further support the channel, the links to our Patreon and merchandise store are down in the description below. Keep spreading the word about this channel. Let's keep this thing growing. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon.